guys, welcome back to Festive Forever. I have noticed one thing about Kandivli that there are many restaurants, probably because of the location or outgoing locality. But today, I have decided to visit Fisco Restro Bar, which is located in Mahavin Nagar. This restaurant has taken a game up for all the vegetarian people out there. Let's go. There are many choices or varieties to choose from. मतलब अगर आप vegetarian food खा रहे हो तो आपको बहुत सारे choices यहाँ पर मिल जाएंगे. Right from the paneer, khao sui, and then pav bhaji, pizza, paneer in a form of shorts. I wanted to try khao sui because it's been so, it's been such a long time. I have actually tried khao sui. I remember the last time I had khao sui was at my brother's wedding. So yeah, I have opted for veg khao sui because everything that you get here is just veg. So let's look at the ingredients. This is fried onion, then garlic, fried garlic, peanuts, green chilies, coriander, and noodles. So we have many things. I'm gonna add some onions first because I like onions, fried onions. Then next we're gonna add some garlic. fried garlic all these ingredients do enhance the taste and flavor of khao sui some peanuts green chilies i have to add it it's like spice of life then some coriander noodles i'm not going to add that much but then maybe some okay I have a feeling that it's going to be super yummy. I have this thing that I feel that whenever you're eating khao sui, the first thing you should do is smell. The khao sui is fragrant, then I think it's on point. So let's go ahead and eat it. Wow. Marvelous, guys. The taste of coconut super a 10 on 10 dish. Mm all the ingredients that i have added is just enhancing the taste and flavor of this dish is tasting so fab there is a hint of lemon grass in it look at this consistency so thick a must try lemon grass pasand hai to hi order karna because it has a bit a little bit of lemon grass but otherwise coconut is so yummy and the yellow color too good a 10 on 10 dish a must try dish at this restaurant we all have heard about cheese fondue but here they have tried to recreate or give a creative touch to our regular pav bhaji by creating a fondue out of it so here we have our pav bhaji which is like piping hot then onions with lemon and probably some red chili powder and two bowls of pav So maybe these are two or three pavs, but two bowl to have pav kit. And here we have our skewer. So I'm gonna take one, a small bite of it because ये थोड़ा सा ज़्यादा हो जाएगा. So I'm taking this bite. I'm not sure कि मतलब ऐसे पाव भाजी खाना थोड़ा difficult हो रहा है. Now the bite is big, guys. I'm little uh, confused about it. So what I'm gonna do is. I'm going to keep this aside. Take power in my hand and eat it like a normal person. Mmm. Pavaji is yummy. But the concept seems to be a flop show. Let's squeeze some lemon on the top. Bhaji, add some onions. Mm. 
पाव भाजी इज सो स्पाइसी पटेटोज आर लिटिल मैश एंड आफ्टर एडिंग लेमन टू इट ऐसा खट्टा खट्टा भी टेस्ट आ रहा है थोड़ा सा सब बटर भी लगाया है बट बटर का उतना टेस्ट नहीं है लाइक फाइव परसेंट टेस्ट आएगा बाकी तो भाजी का ही टेस्ट आ रहा है इन थोड़ा स्पाइसी है बिकॉज इन पाव ऑल्सो दे हैव एडेड रेड चिली पाउडर इन अनियंस ऑल्सो दे हैव एडेड रेड चिली पाउडर सो द स्पाइसीनेस ऑफ और रेड चिली पाउडर का जो टेस्ट है वो थोड़ा ज़्यादा आएगा लेमन की वजह से थोड़ा खट्टा टेस्ट आएगा एंड या I guess you will enjoy this pav bhaji but just use your hands about this restaurant that they have taken a different route or try to give a twist to every single dish that they are serving like pav bhaji was in fondue form now i have called for paneer masala basket so they have made basket from the bread added paneer in it cheese in it and tried to recreate the recipe whenever you have indian food the issue that you feel that you people don't get creative with it so this restaurant has not only attempted that but successfully created it on the top that the quantity that they are serving is pretty much good like one dish two dish it would be enough for you now this dish is called paneer masala basket which i'm going to lift one and serve myself so they also don't serve um, regular water you get these bottles at regular prices matlab 10 rupaya 5 rupaya jo bhi price hai and uh, apparently i guess they don't want to serve tomato ketchup in uh, bowls they have just given this entire thing to me and it's also new so you can add some tomato ketchup on the side I am not really fond of tomato ketchup. This is the basket that they have tried to recreate with bread and on the top they have added cheese. अगर आप इसे खोल के देखोगे तो इसमें बहुत सारा पनीर डाला है शिमला मिर्च डाली है basically पनीर मसाला Mostly people serve as a sabzi with naan or roti. They have given a different twist and tried to create a basket out of it, which is something very unique. On the top also they have added black olive to give a better look. Now let's go ahead and eat it. I'm going to break this thing because obviously I cannot put this entirely in my mouth. The bread is very crispy. Mmm. पनीर की क्वांटिटी इसमें भर भर के डाली है दो इट्स पनीर मसाला इट्स नॉट रियली स्पाइसी एंड आई हैव अ फीलिंग दैट पनीर जो है बेसिकली पनीर की जो ग्रेवी है दे हैव मेड इट ऑन तवा दैट्स वाई इट हैज दिस तवा वाला फ्लेवर एंड यू नो वेन यू एड टमेटोज अनियंस इन ऑयल एंड जैसे वो फ्राइड रिलीज करता है एंड देन यू मैश इट समवेयर सो दैट कैंड ऑफ अ टेस्ट आई कैन फील बेसिकली अनियंस एंड टमेटोज हैव बिन फ्राइड एंड देन मैश एंड उसमें रेड चिली पाउडर डाला है टर्मरिक डाला है सो वैसा पनीर तवा मसाला जैसा टेस्ट आ रहा है विच आई एम इन्जॉइंग इट समवेयर वेरी टेस्टी वेरी अमी बट नॉट स्पाइसी probably because they have added paneer and uh, cheese on the top that's why it's not really tasty it's not really tasting spicy one more thing i notice about this dish is that they have also added kidney beans in it so yeah do give it a try it's yummy we are moving on to our last dish of the day yahan par na zyada food you cannot call for because the quantity is so much and at the same time since it's 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 an indian food इट्स क्वाइट फिलिंग एट द सेम टाइम यू नो दैट इंडियन फूड थोड़ा हैवी होता है खाने के लिए उसकी वजह से यू के नॉट ईट दैट मच सो नाउ वी हैव क्रंची पनीर शॉर्ट्स द प्रेजेंटेशन अगेन सीम्स टू बी क्रिएटिव ऑन पॉइंट लेट सी द क्राफ्टीनेस ऑफ दिस क्रंची पनीर एट द बॉटम दे हैव एडेड सालसा सॉस देन पनीर सम क्रीम एंड नाचोस बेसिकली नाचोस को क्रश करके डाला है वेरी गुड अटैम्प्ट टू क्रिएट अ क्रिएटिव डिश एंड ऑफकोर्स देर फिस्को रेस्टो बार टैग आई गेस दर सासा सॉस सीम्स टू बी वेरी स्पाइसी बिकॉज द मोमेंट आई हैड इट 
it started hitting me here so the spiciness of this dish is little extra yes the paneer is very crunchy i have a feeling that they must have added some other batter too because it's not outright paneer what they have done is they have added corn flour and paneer together along with some vegetables corn flour ki quantity isme thodi si zyada hai That's why outright ऐसा पनीर का taste नहीं आएगा थोड़ा corn flour का भी taste आएगा अभी sauce के साथ you know what's happening? They have added Tabasco sauce in it. That's why you know Tabasco sauce somewhere had has that fishy kind of a smell. तो वैसा थोड़ा सा smell आएगा but of course it's a vegetarian restaurant. There is no fish. Otherwise I guess if you like spicy crunchy paneer balls with a hint of nachos then you will love it. बट येस नाचोज का इसमें कोई टेस्ट नहीं आएगा बिकॉज विद द टाइम इट विल बिकम ऑल सॉगी सो गैस नाउ इट्स टाइम टू रेड दिस प्लेस ऑन माई फेस्टिव मीटर आई हैव टू एडमिट वन थिंग अबाउट दिस रेस्टोरेंट और अ प्लस पॉइंट दैट द क्वान्टिटी वाइज रेस्टोरेंट इज वेरी गुड दे सर्व अूज क्वान्टिटी Hardly, I think if you're coming here and there are two people, then two people can call for two dish, or even one dish would be, you know, filling for two people depending upon what you're calling for, of course. At the same time, it's also very pocket friendly. The dishes are not that expensive. One dish would cost you somewhere around three hundred, which is very good. Kudos to the restaurant that they have tried to recreate. or try to give you know that creative touch to each and every dish that they are serving so i like that part about it so considering all the factors i'm going to rate this place 8.5 out of 10 on my festive meter quantity for quantity i would like to give this place 10 ambiance is 8 and the uh, quality is 8.5 and my overall experience is 8.5 So guys I think that's all for today if you're new to my channel please don't forget to like share and subscribe also follow me on my instagram that is festive forever 4 so that's all for today i'm going to see you in my next vlog till then live life festive style bye bye yeah i think uh, eating pav bhaji like this is little difficult